Jersey Sports Zone's coverage of Shawnee is being brought to you by Cooper University Healthcare. Week 4 wraps up in Winslow Township where the Eagles host Shawnee. This is a rematch of last season's Central Group 4 Championship game. Winslow won that one, but the Eagles are still looking for their first victory of 2022. First quarter, Winslow facing fourth and goal from the 24-yard line. Watch Jimmy Wilson go to work. The quarterback is going to try to run for it. Wilson charging toward the end zone, and he gets there. What an effort from Jimmy Wilson. A 24-yard touchdown run on fourth and goal to give the Eagles a 7-0 lead. Second quarter now, it's Wilson to a Johnny Shakir. The Penn State commit making people miss, stretches for the goal line, but it's ruled a fumble. The ball goes back a few yards and out of bounds to set up first and goal. Jamil Peterson can take it from there. Peterson muscles his way in from four yards out. It's all Eagles early as Winslow makes it 14 to nothing. But Ethan Kraus returns the ensuing kickoff 72 yards to give Shawnee excellent field position. Renegades down to the one now when Joe Papa scores on the quarterback sneak. Papa gets Shawnee on the board as the Renegades trail 14 to seven. Just over two minutes to go in the half now. Shawnee with the ball again. Nick Rosinski on the carry. Rosinski able to bounce it to the outside, and he sprints in for the score. A 41-yard touchdown run from Nick Rosinski. And just like that, we're all tied up at 14. Winslow trying to go back on top before the break. Throwing to the end zone, but Kraus picks off the pass. Ethan Kraus with the interception in the end zone and it's a tie game at intermission. Winslow recovers a fumble early in the third and cashes in. Peterson on the carry again. Jamil Peterson around the right side, a ton of contact inside the five, but he fights through it and scores. A tough run for Peterson as he scores his second touchdown of the night. The 15 yard rumble makes it 21 to 14. All right, just over four minutes left in the fourth now. Winslow driving and trying to ice this one. The Renegades have other ideas. Shawnee is able to force a fumble and the Renegades recover. Dan Scullion gets on the ball. So Shawnee still very much in the game. Papa is injured on the ensuing drive though. Kraus taking most of the snaps at QB. He's back at wide receiver though here on fourth and 17. Jack Connors launches one down the far sideline. Kraus makes the catch. A clutch grab from Ethan Kraus. And the Renegades drive continues. Shawnee facing third and goal now with under a minute left and no timeouts. Shawnee has some trouble with the snap and the Eagles swoop in. Jeremiah Taylor leading the charge. So now the Renegades are in serious trouble. The ball is back at the 10. So fourth and goal from there. Remember no timeouts. Time running out and Shawnee loses track of the downs. They clock the ball on fourth down and that'll do it. Winslow somehow hangs on. 21 to 14 the final. Peterson well over 100 yards on the ground plus the two touchdowns to lead the way as the Eagles earn their first victory of the season and the first career victory for head coach Bill Belton. Winslow now one and two overall and will host Ocean City next Saturday night. An absolute heartbreaker for Shawnee as the Renegades drop to three and two. They'll host St. Augustine on Friday night. In Atco, I'm Mike Frankel, JerseySportsZone.com.